Many child care programs are weighing decisions on staying open or to close programs, and the truth is there is no right or wrong answer, but the, the reality is that we need them, and we need them to help our frontline health care workers or our folks who are going to be working in our grocery stores that we know are going to see a, a, a change here, our pharmacies. Um, and we are working hard to give them the best guidance possible that they can take. Um, and so we will continue to support them in every way that we can. And for those who decide that they can remain open um, to serve our families, to fuel our economy, we're so grateful um, to them because we do very much value them, but, but know that on uh, the great news in this, and I'll say this as a mom of a five and an eight-year-old, um, is that while some of us can do this hard work to respond to the, to the virus, to know that if our children got sick, that, that the severity of illness is so, is so much less for them, is so comforting as a parent. I think we want to make sure that those on our, the front lines of our, our, uh, in our health care workforce have the opportunity to be, that, be at work and to focus um, on those patients that are going to need their care.